James, at least sit with me for a while. Yeah, I got an urgent email to send. This is what I get. Temper tantrums and hostility, all for trying to help Ella. You're not being fair. If that's what you think, you better get in touch with your conscience. Uh, Ella, I bought porridge. You want to eat before you go to work? Uh, no. Uh, yeah, you just came. Sorry, I gotta go. Uh, yeah, this girl, uh, always rushing here and there, you know. Ay. Hey, why are you here? How did you know I'll be here? You mentioned to me this place before. Said the Tahoe next door very good. I'm so stupid. Why? Not happy to see me? We just said goodbye eight hours ago. Couldn't get enough of you. Uh, you know the rules. I don't do things like that. You only pay for my time, that's all. I'll pay you extra. Not enough. Is that her business partner? Ma, can you help me tap out two Tahui? Thanks. Okay. Let's not talk here. How much then? Too rich for you. <laughs> Try me. Let's go somewhere else. Very well. If there's no further business, I declare the meeting over. Please, help yourself to more refreshments. Oh, I, I have an announcement. I have vouchers for organic ginseng from any home -air shop. You just have to show the online coupon, which I'll send you shortly. And enjoy. How sweet of you. Thank you, Celia. Oh, you can thank Eunice. She's backing my campaign for chairperson. Is she? Interesting. What, dear? Madeline Chan and Louis are seen together. It's not that great a coincidence that her father might soon be voted onto the board. A happy coincidence. No, a power play. Your imagination is running wild, Jessica. Ella! Where's he? Who? That guy you're with just now. He's one of your sugar daddies, right? What sugar daddy? Don't be a day. It's not just that one time right. In fact, this is your full-time job, right? I don't know what you're on about. I already explained everything to you. Yeah. That day after you explained, I went to check. I asked my friends who knew about this sort of thing. Last night, I even found your website. So don't try to lie to me anymore. I've proof. Yo, did Louis tell you anything about Madeline Chan? No. Apparently, there are plans to match make Louis and Madeline. They are hoping to leverage on the chance to strengthen Louis's position in KSUH. Who's they? Celia, Eunice, and your father. I suspect Eunice is throwing her weight behind this, hoping to reclaim her power as chairwoman of the board. Well, good for her. Good for her? Yo. Your position in the company could be shaky. How so? If Louis marries Madeline and Michael Chan is on the board, then Louis may gain more supporters. Good for him. Seriously, yo, this is no joke. You need to move your wedding day forward. Why? What for? Because Shen's family will lend weight to me. No, I'm not even going to ask him. Listen to me, yo. No, you listen. When I started work here, you need to try to get me fired. James made my life difficult. Everyone thought I wouldn't last, but I'm still here. And I will be here even if Louis marries Madeline. So just let me do my job. And I assure you, I'm safe. Bye. So you've seen my website. So what? I'm a sugar baby. It's not a crime. Nobody gets hurt. It's easy money and I get paid to have a good time. You get money to spend time with men. You know how cheap that makes you. Don't make it sound so dirty. I don't do anything more than chat and provide a listening ear. Think that's the only thing men want? Sooner or later, they'll demand more from you. Then I won't meet them anymore. You think you're so clever that everything is under your control? Yes. Nobody controls my life but me. Not you, not Mewan, not James Shelley. Ella, you don't feel shameful. If my girlfriend did something like that, I will never marry her. If my mom finds out, she'll be so heartbroken. She won't find out unless you blab about it. Do you know about this? You knew, but you kept quiet. Even help her to lie. Because I knew you'd be angry, like now. I... I tried to stop Ella, I really did. But you tried to stop me. Then you should have told me so I can stop her. Huh. 
Ella's been through a lot, okay? Give her a break. She must have her reasons for doing this. What reasons? I'll tell you one. It's Debbie. Ella? She's my wonderful business partner. In fact, she was the one who got me in, showed me the ropes and even introduced customers to me. You're also doing this? No, it's not like that. I can explain this. You tell me you want to be exclusive and then you do this? Worse, you drag Ella in and taught her all the bad things. First, handsome. Now, Ella? No, it's not like that. Ella, tell him. It's not funny. It was all her idea. That's not true, Hop. You have to believe me. Enough! I don't want to hear anymore. I also don't want to see you anymore. Stay away from us. Think I don't they? Go ahead. Tell her daughter is a shameless prostitute. Break her heart. Aya, Hawk, Ella, where were y'all? Just now, so many people. I got no time to go toilet. Ma, sit down. I need to tell you something. Why? Is everything okay? You sit down first. What happened? It's about Debbie. Didn't you check the numbers, Yog? Sorry, I missed it. Come on, Yog. That missing zero could have been a huge loss for us. I expected more from you. Why? If it isn't Superwoman Ananya. Hi, Mr. Yo. It's been a while. Good to see you. <laughs> I see Charles finally did the right thing to rehire you. It's about time. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see you. Looking good. Head of Regional Development. It's a good portfolio. Mm -hmm. Tough, though. Well, you know me. I'm always up for a challenge. <laughs> we should catch up. Anytime. I'll get my PA to arrange it. See you, Mr. Yo. Why did you break up with Debbie? I thought you were very happy with her. Happy? She did so many bad things. I tried to close one eye until I cannot tahan anymore. Ma, I didn't want to tell you because I know you'll be upset. She's very good. She's always helping me. Ma, she cheated on me. You mean she was seeing other men? And lied about it. Plus, she was working for a bookie and even got handsome to be a runner for the bookie. What? Luckily, I found out. I stopped all the nonsense. Aya, when did this happen? Why didn't you tell me? I just found out also. That's why I give up on Debbie. She's nothing but trouble. And you'll drag everyone around her down. You stay away from her, you hear me not? What are you doing here? I came to say sorry. Sorry? You took advantage of Handsome and got him to do all the illegal things for you. I know it was wrong of me to put Handsome in danger. I'm not running for the bookie anymore. I swear. I also can swear. But you never change. Auntie Meiwan, please give me a chance. I'm really very sorry. I gave you so many chances. Even treat you like my family. You betrayed my trust. You made use of Handsome. You hurt my family. No. No more chance. I don't want to see you again. You stay away from us! Go! Hey, Debbie, where are you going? I'm sorry. What happened? Why did you let Ananya walk all over you? She's upset over a mistake that I made. Yo, you are a Shelly. She doesn't have the right to treat you that way. She's been back one month and she's already walking all over you. And she knows she can get away with it because she has Charles's backing. Again with the office politics. Did you really think 
that Lewis could have hired Ananya without Charles's approval? Everyone here knows that Charles holds the power, and Ananya's loyalty is with the most powerful, because that's how she thrives. First it was your father, then James, and now it's Charles, who probably engineered her rehire. You're reading way too much into this. Am I? Even Jeffrey didn't think much of you. I'm going to have to do something about that. Kak, I made ikan hariwan soup for Zara. Do you think I can visit her? Um, I don't know if she's ready to receive visitors. I haven't spoken much to her. Oh, with Chi Adina being away, is she okay? Um, I guess so. Razali has been there for her. Zarif is trying, despite his busy schedule. Ah, uh, Zarif. Okay. If not, he can pass the soup on my behalf. Do that. You're nervous. It's been years since I dated anyone. Just treat it as a get-to-know-you session. That's even worse. What if I tell Louis something which I think that it isn't a big deal and it turns out it really turns him off? Well, he's not perfect too, so I guess that makes you guys even. Anyway, you guys have known each other for so long and you have been getting really close. So this is just to make things official. Official? Yeah, that you're a couple. Hey! What's up, crap? Great, you're here. Get your things, I'm kicking you out. You have no right. I pay for half the rent. I am the main tenant. My signature is on the list. I'll find someone else, someone who won't betray me. It wasn't me! Hawk was the one who blabbed to me one! Only because of you! Me! The bookie! How you made a handsome runner! That's all true! Yeah, but not the part about how I got you in the business. You chose it yourself. Who was the one who showed me the ropes, taught me the tricks, even introduced clients to me? Then you turn around and say, I'm too weak and immature to do this. What the crap? You were strong enough, you wouldn't have gotten mixed up with that Dr. Shen again. I warn you as a friend. And this is what you do to me. Are you really sure how much of a friend you are? Join me under the bus to save your relationship with Hawk. What do you expect me to do? You know how much I like him. I was afraid to lose him. Now, look what has happened, huh? Auntie May Wan won't even give me another chance. So go away. Go away! Fine. This place is crap anyway. I wanted to move out long ago. Well, Rose is certainly full of surprises. I would have never expected her to make the first move. What was I thinking? I shouldn't have said yes. Why? I thought this is what you wanted. Rose and I can never happen. She likes you, you like her. Everyone's pressuring me to marry Madeline. Excuse me, everyone? I'm not. No, I'm Michelle Ian's. It's what I have to do. Is that one of Eunice's favourite quotes? Louis, look at where James is now. And not to mention Eunice's own marriage to Derek. <sighs> to tell you the truth, I've never seen Rose so happy in the last few weeks. Do you know she once told me that she had given up on love? She did? Yes. I guess now she has hope again. I mean, I've noticed a big change in her. But... But what? Let me ask you this. Do you love her? With all my heart. Then follow your heart, Louis. Why bother with what other people say? This is your life. Do you want to look back with regret? Wondering what could have been? Ma, I can't get Ella. Maybe she's busy. Will she be okay? Ella is a survivor. She'll be fine. Did she and Debbie fight? Oh, 
Hawk and Debbie broke up. Why? Many reasons. Tell me why. Busy body. It's complicated, okay? Anyway, just so that you know, Debbie won't be coming here so much, okay? So she can't be my friend anymore? She can't come here anymore. Oh, then Ella, she'll still come here, right? I hope so. Thanks for dinner, Louis. It was really good. My pleasure. And look, no cameras around. <laughs> no one's gonna bother us. It's really nice to have a quiet chat. And uh, I'm so sorry about what happened with Rita. Don't worry about it. I'm positive I had extra cash to tip him. I didn't go shopping. I usually make sure I have at least $50 on me. You know, sometimes I forget what's in my wallet. And that doesn't include the times I'm drunk. Louis! Louis, stop it! <laughs> hey, you, um, you up for dessert? I know a very good 24 hour place. Louis, we just had dessert. <laughs> just say yes. I'm trying to make this night last as long as I can. Okay. Great. Does this mean you're official? <laughs> when I said I'll let you set the pace, I was expecting you to take it really slow. Uh, is it too fast for you? No. <sighs> Sorry. Yes, yeah, Celia? Oh, no. Um... Okay, I'll be right back. Bye. I'm so sorry. I can't do this. Is everything okay? Something came up at Adina's. Oh well. You gotta do what you gotta do, right? Yeah. I know exactly how it is. Here. Not a word from her. Yeah, I have to go back and get that she get some rest. How many times must I beg her? I've sent her countless messages. It's like talking to a wall. Yes or no, that's all I need. Young, if there's no reply, it's probably a no. And they say silence means yes? That Ella we met yesterday was hostile. She was looking for a fight, hoping to get a rise out of us. But she didn't say no, right? How long are you gonna keep on waiting? That's all I can do, right? See you. What for? Meet me at Jalan Tech Deer. Sounds like things could get really serious. No, well, it was all good until she had to rush off to Adina's. Some urgent call as usual. It happens. Yeah, it does. But doesn't it suck when that's not what she was supposed to do in the first place? I mean, this is the Hassan's restaurant, and she keeps slaving for them, and they don't even appreciate her. Well, that's the long-suffering rose for you. Do you want to be like her? I don't want to disappoint Dad. Like, there's a lot riding on my marriage to Madeline. Nothing makes your father happy. The question is, do you want to be happy? Do you want to make Rose happy and take her away from those terrible Hassans? I'm here. What do you want? I heard about what happened. From who? You're spying on me? You're coming to stay with me. No! 
Ella. I don't need your pity. It's not pity. I don't want to see you out on the streets. I'm not. I already found a place to stay. Nice, swanky place. I'm on my way there. Then at least let me help you get to I don't the want anything to do with you. Ella, you deserve much better than this. I hate seeing you like this. Ella, please. Just stay away from me. I mean it. Oh, I'll run away so far, you'll never find me again. But don't walk away and let me be. So won't you save me from my... Have you heard from Ella? No. Oh. Yeah. I've seen her for two days already. She's okay. Are you sure? Maybe uh, she's on Debbie's side. Uh. That's why uh, she's angry with us. If she did, then she's really stupid, right? Because Debbie cheated on me. Maybe she had a fight with Debbie uh, because she feels bad for you. Hmm. But she should have come here, right? You're not worried about your sister? Uh, yeah, you know her. She only shows up anytime she wants. Don't worry. Hope so.